Hi crafty friends. Okay guys, we are going to do another Christmas in July project. So I had gotten these, la uh, was it last year I think it is, these gift bags from the Dollar Tree and I love snowmen so I thought this one was going to be a lot of fun. So what I'm doing is out of those little wood uh, pieces there from the Dollar Tree, I'm just making the size of the sign that I want and I'm just holding them together with some craft sticks. We're going to put a, a bleh. <laughs> Words are hard today again. Um, I'm going to put a coat of white paint onto this and then just kind of hit the edges. You can paint the back if you want to. You don't have to though, especially if it's leaning up towards something uh, like the wall or something like that. Um, and then I'm going to uh, cut out the bag. Listen, Dollar Tree has really upped their game on bags, especially... Um, Sorry, I got totally distracted. I'm looking out the window and I thought the horse got out. Okay, anyways, no, we're back. Okay, so Dollar Tree has amazing gift bags. This year they had some really cool birthday ones and you can use them for wall art. You can do so many different things with them. Uh, so that's what we're doing here. So once I um, that paint is all the way dry, you see I put a little bit of Mod Podge on there and then I'm just going to lay down the bag over the top of it. So all we got to do once we um, get the coat of, or put a coat, I should say, of the Mod Podge over the top of it, and that's dry, then we're going to trim uh, the excess around the wood pieces. And once it's dry, I love to use a sanding block. That's the easiest way for me, you guys. Plus, it just kind of sands the edges a little bit. Then we're going to use some antiquing wax, and we're going to start going around the edges of this. I love everything that has a little bit of distress to it. So you could really do a ton here or as little as you uh, uh, as you want, but I love the antiquing wax. It is so easy to use. And then I'm just going to kind of dab it on and dab it off and just kind of go over the top of the whole piece here. Um, again, just to give a little bit of antiquing so it doesn't look like it's a brand new <laughs> white bag sitting on top of wood. So then one of their uh, scarves that they have, we're gonna cut that up and we're going to tie that around. I just think this is the cutest bag ever really hope they have it again this year because that face is adorable. So uh, we're going to tie this around the bottom. I mean, if this doesn't make you happy, I love Christmas in July. And I'm not going to do the whole month, by the way. I'm just going to do a couple more projects for you guys. But we're going to fluff that up. And then I got these pom-poms, um, the three different colors here from Dollar Tree also. I love that they're continuing to have those and lots of other colors too. But I thought, ooh, let's add a little bit to the edge of the scarf just to, you know, add a little bit more of fun to it. You could totally skip this part, but look how adorable this sign is. I just love it so much. All right, friends, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to follow for more.